So did you did you have any involvement in the uh, the death of the male that we just spoke about a short while ago? Is it Gabriel Cavari or Gabriel Klein? No, I didn't. At all. Were you involved in administering any drugs or poisons or noxious substances to him? No, I don't administer drugs to anyone or give drugs to anyone. Um, that's done at the party by someone else. The name I recognised one of the parties mentioned before was the, is one of the parties who deals with uh, administrating drugs. Who, who's that, sorry? Uh, Daniel. I recognised him. He sometimes he's at, he's at, he deals he hands out the drugs to uh, the guests. Daniel, this is the male yeah. that we spoke of earlier. So, yeah. It might not be the same guy, I really don't know, but is there only Daniel I'd know? Or I mean, I've spoken to him a couple of times at the party, remembering his name. He, was, he does, like, when I did, Scott would ask him to pick up guys, take them to the party, mm -hmm. and he would, but he would stay, but I wouldn't, he would stay in the ministry, or do out the, hand out the, you know, drugs or whatever, but I, uh, I would leave, or he would stay. And did you go with Daniel to meet people? No, no, he's, I knew he was doing the same as I was, but I'd see him at that party, and there's a brief conversation with him about it but I've never actually engaged with him outside of a, a place. Outside of a party? Right. And which parties were these? Uh, well, he's got the, the fat parties. Scots parties? Yeah. The fat party? Fat party, F-R-A-T. Frat parties. So when was the first occasion that you met the person that you're, you're talking of, uh, someone that you know as Daniel? Um, that was one of the first few occasions I was I was there. It was the first time I bought a guy for Scott and Daniel was there. Um, I said, I don't even know if it is the same Daniel I was talking about, but he's the only Daniel I would can recall as such. Um, I remember, I think his name was Whitworth, it rings a bell, but... You think his name was Whitworth? Yeah. I mean, if he's a tall, almost as tall as me, I think brown hair, slim, uh... Might help if I show um, your picture. I'll call this CRT. So this is Jack Taylor. Do you recognise that mate? No. full attention to the guy's faces when I have paid attention to the um, parties this, um, but I don't recognise his face. So, so you don't recognise his face? I do not know, no. Okay. Yeah. And, and I mean they, that's Jack Taylor, so you don't recognise no, Jack Taylor? No. So have you ever slept with this male? No. Has sexual intercourse with him? He doesn't look like the type I'd go with myself. He's not the sort of person you'd go for? No, I tend to more... He's more younger, drinky boys, more, you know, more younger boys, but not... Uh, he looks older. Be similar to the type I've taken to, to parties, but I don't recognise him as being one of them. So you don't recognise him as being one of them? No. No. Okay. 
and, and Jack again was, was found dead this was on, the 20, on the 14th of September 2015 Stephen did you have any involvement in his death? I did not know No. did you kill Jack Taylor? I did not know did you administer any drugs or noxious substances to him? I did not know. With the intention of causing him harm? No. no. Definitely not. No. no. And you say you've never seen him before. Is that right? That's right. That's right. Okay, I've got another map here, CRT8. I'm just trying to show you as many maps of the area because it's not easy to get it all in one one uh, piece of paper, just so that we're, we're clear here. Uh, and again, it shows your uh, home address and it shows uh, the church, St Margaret, and the, the, behind it you've got the, uh, the abbey and the primary school. In particular, the area around um, the walls of the abbey. Have you ever had any reason to go into that area? No. Have you, ever, have you ever been uh, through into the Abbey? Uh, no, I haven't. No. No, I don't really go to touch areas. No. No. One, went, one once went to that church. With my ex Denny, went to the church on a, on a Christmas day um, and into the church, but as far as I got, as far as I. You've not been into the grounds behind it where you've got the the uh, old abbey oh, no, no, it looks walls. No, no, it looks the grounds there. No, it looks a spooky sign, won't go there. You've never, you've never been in there? No. In all the eight years that you've lived across the road from the park? No. I thought it was all private, I wouldn't go there. I think it's private area, I thought. But also the church. It's, it's fairly open, isn't it, when you when you go past? Would you agree with that or not? In the field, yeah, the yeah. field is. But uh, the church bit behind the walls, we would go past there. Because um, three of the four people that have been found dead were found uh, slumped up against the wall here of the Abbey. Pardon? Yeah, I didn't know that. So. You didn't know that? So that's news to you, is it? Yeah. Did you put them there? No. So obviously Anthony was found slumped outside your address with uh, a large amount of GHB in his system. The other three men we've been discussing were all found over by the wall area of the abbey, we can see on the map. Uh, again, all of them were slumped against the wall with a large amount of GHB in their body. Can you account for that at all? No, I can't. I mean, Stephen, did you did you write this letter? Yeah, CLT eleven. No, I didn't. The photos of it that's found with Daniel. No. No. If you're not. Are you telling us the truth, Stephen? I am telling you the truth, yes. About the letter. Yes. I have sent you. About all of these boys. Yeah. Young boys. in the early stages of their youth, really, in terms of in their early 20s. All found dead. Stephen? Yeah, I understand, but... Close to your house. One of them had been in your house, either just before at the time when he died, and was found to have large quantities of a drug in his system. The other three were all found just over the road in the churchyard or just beside the churchyard in that area that we've discussed, yeah. propped up against a wall, short distance from your house, all again with 
high levels of GHB in them, enough to kill them. Highly unusual way to die for one person. This is four all found very close to where you live. All men, young men, the type of men that you say that you find attractive. All now dead, Stephen. Anthony, I know nothing about the other three, how they come to be. Stephen, this is serious. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. It's really important that you tell us the absolute truth. So far, it's true. 